so I'm Stacy Ferreira from MySocialCloud.com. I'm the co-founder and VP. And MySocialCloud.com is an online platform that allows people to manage and organize their online life. So their usernames and passwords and those bookmarks that are typically in your browser, bringing those out to the public and showing people the things that you're interested in online. So my social cloud started because of a computer crash. My brother was getting ready for finals and his computer crashed and he lost everything that's important online. And so we set out to build this platform that allows people to organize all of that information, all their usernames and passwords and auto log them into all of those sites and all of the bookmarks that are in their browser and putting those online so that you'd never lose them. We kind of have an interesting story of how we got our funding. I saw a tweet um, on Twitter from Sir Richard Branson that said, come meet me in Miami for intimate cocktails, donate $2,000 to charity, and then it gave an email address. And so I took the email address and said, you know, I'm not old enough to drink cocktails, but I would love to come meet you. And so I got an email back later that night and they said, you know, get to Miami in 48 hours, donate the $2,000 and you can meet Richard Branson. So I did and spent two days with him and he was really intrigued with our idea and what we were doing. And then we got his contact details, stayed in touch. And about a month later, he introduced us to Jerry Murdoch, who is also an investor. And he said, you know, Branson and I are going to invest in your company. So yeah, we definitely see mobile as the next biggest space. Um, people are getting further and further away from their large devices like laptops. They're moving more towards things like tablets and iPhones. And, and that's a big thing for us too, saying that, you know, you need continuity across all your devices um, and making sure that we're available on all those platforms is huge for us. With increased spectrum, what that means for us is that more people are able to get on these networks and use all of the things that we're building and multiple other startups across the nation are building so that people don't have, you know, all these downtimes and, oh, I'm not able to access the things that I need to access because there's not enough spectrum out there for us and my social cloud and a lot of other startups out there, you know, putting regulations on things that cost more money or um, deal with privacy are big things for startups, right? Because money isn't something that's readily available for a lot of startups. And so if you start putting regulations on that and charging people a lot of money for that, then that hinders the ability for these businesses to be formed because they simply don't have the money to do that. So with my social cloud, we've just relaunched a new redesign of the site, and we're really excited to launch this mobile app, as I was mentioning, um, in January. So we'll be out on iOS and then out on Android a little bit after that. Um, so yeah, I just encourage everyone to go check those out and let us know if they have feedback. So the thing that I really like about Cal Innovates, and I checked on your Facebook and all these other places, and just the, the articles and the things that you guys were posting were awesome things that really excite, at least me, being in this field. You know, these are issues that not a lot of people know about, that once you get into researching them, you're like, this is something that people need to be educated about. And that's something that really struck me, is that you guys are going out and educating people on these topics that people don't know about, but they need to know about, especially in this field.